1952, long before he became president of the United States, Jimmy Carter was in the U.S. Navy working on submarines. Meanwhile, at the Chalk River facility in Canada, there was a severe power excursion at the experimental NRX nuclear reactor. For 62 seconds, a reactor with a maximum power capacity of only 30 megawatts had just surged to between 60 and 100 megawatts as a result of reactor design flaws, user error, and miscommunication during a test. As the uranium rods partially melted and contacted air, a hydrogen explosion occurred, rupturing the cooling system, which began to flood the basement with radioactive water. Numerous personnel assisted with cleanup of the reactor over the next 14 months. Among them was a young lieutenant in the Navy, Jimmy Carter. For days, they practiced disassembly of a mock reactor in preparation of their mission. Eventually, Jimmy Carter and his team entered the reactor building and in 90-second intervals disassembled the reactor bit by bit, exposing themselves to amounts of radiation far exceeding allowable limits today.